Most people who practice the pendulum, or what I like to call it, is coined as a term for my business practice of making them called faith fobs. As the whole premise is it is a faith instrument. It is a tool of which to practice my faith and submission to the Lord. By using my pendulum, I have found many blessings from God. By using my pendulum to many people, I seem odd. By using my pendulum and my faith, Bob, I have been told off by many Christians and Baptists and Catholics and Lutherans who thought that what I was doing was an abomination to the Lord, and I just sit and laugh because they're the ones in struggle and in trouble all the time for the things they say and do, and I don't have those problems. Do you? You see, while I might be a priest, a pagan priest, which means I have three vows that I practice and I utter aloud. I have the vow of chastity, which means that I keep myself purely for the woman that I love. And I might have three women that are intriguing to me. Two women that I've already met and love, and one that just is fascinating as hell to me that the Lord actually gave me the letters of her name to find, and I didn't know her at all before that game. In life, we have moments of time to allow God to teach us things. God is my teacher in every way, so I don't need any human to try to teach me a lesson today. The Lord is my shepherd in every way, and I am a full proponent and a full publisher and a full promoter of the book of John in the Bible, particularly chapter 10 on the Good Shepherd. I encourage every Christian to read it again and again and again.